Hello and welcome back to another computer sluggish tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to put a image on top of another image in paint. But we're going to make sure that the image that we put on top of the other image is transparent. We're going to go ahead now and open up paint. To do this you need to go down to the bottom left hand corner and type in paint. And we're just going to open up one instance and we're just going to minimize that a bit and move it to the left now and we're going to go on to search again and type in paint again and open up another instance as you can see now I've got two paints on my screen if I just move them slightly over so they're next to each other like that it make things a lot easier right now you need to open up your first image to do this you need to go to the top left hand corner where it says file and we're going to click on that and go to open and you should get a file explorer now I don't know what's happening there it's going behind paint <laughs> that's a bit strange and you need to open up your first image as you can see I've got smoothed fields there I'm going to open that up and we're now going to go on to our other paint window and we're going to open up our other image and as you can see I've got Sonic. Sonic's the image that I want to get on top of this fields image. If I just zoom out a bit then it will be easier to see. There we go and I'm going to do the same on this one. Let's zoom out a little bit. Right, the next step is to go to home and you want to click on select but you want to select this button at the bottom, transparent selection. We're going to click on that and now as you can see it's got a big tick next to it. We're now going to click on rectangle selection. You can always do freeform selection which allows you to easily go round the outside of the image taking care and trying to get as close to the image as you can. But for this video I'm just going to go rectangle. I'm now going to select my whole image, try and get in as much as I can and I'm going to go control and C and I'm now going to go on to this smoothed fields image and I'm going to go control and V. You can always right click as well and go copy and you can right click. No, you can't right click on this image, sorry. You've got to go to home and click on paste or you can go control and V. Before you press paste in your new image, which is this fields one, you actually do need to press down on this select and you need to select transparent selection. Otherwise, it will input the Sonic the Hedgehog with a white background. But if I now go Control and V, as you can see, he's got a transparent background. And it's as easy as that. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.